Jamie the Haymaker Hay here with Ian M16 Butlin and we're on to the heavyweights Ian. Yeah big men here John Marshall is huge taking on Lee Curry who again is big but looks dwarfed by big bad John. Big bad John. Here we go. John's just gonna bully him here, I think. We saw John on the last ice in the northeast. He oh, hits a big shot there. Lee Curry's got nothing here for John. As Move he gets guillotine. guillotine. Up against the cage. That's 160 kilos guillotine. That's really tight that. He's gonna put a lot of pressure on his neck here. Managed nice to get out of that. John going to put some big shots in. Any kind of shot in these fights and not the, not oh, the other one out. With heavyweights like this, Jamie, any single shot can finish the fight. A lot of pressure up against the cage from John. Dragged his man to the ground. Happy to sit in half guard now. He's going to drop some elbows. Gonna drop some elbows now from this position. Well, he's got his supporters there coming into the corner. If, in his defense, Lee Curry is doing a good job of holding on, stopping John from doing anything of any sort of substance. Yeah, you know, he's, he's John's got the, the uh, nice half guard there, just gonna, he's a big, big guy, isn't he? He is, but. You know, I'd like to see him, um, you know, get his head clear, land some of these big shots. Lee Curry's not giving him anything back at all. He's just sort of sat underneath. So, yeah, you know, Big John now looking to sort of rain some shots down for me. I'd like to see him a little bit more active from this position now. He's, he's just not doing enough for me. You know, he's got a good position. He just needs to get his head clear, land some shots. He could get a finish here. He's just, just too ready to lay on top. Yes, yeah, so, you know, he's sat in half guard here. And we're sort of halfway through the round here, and really, you know, this is the fight, I think, I think John could have finished this. Trevor Mitchell's gonna have to stand them back up. Nothing much going on at all. Yeah, he, you know, it's the odd flurry, but there's not enough going in there for, uh, for Mitchell to stop to step in on this. You know, if I was 160 kilos and I was top on someone, I'd like to think I'd have finished this fight by now. Yeah, he's putting up a good defence. He's Curry at the minute. And there we go. Yeah, that's, gonna drop, that's a good stand-up from up. referee Trevor Mitchell. We need to see more action from both these guys now. We really do. So well, here we go, nice jab there. the big fellas throwing bombs at each other. Good needle there from Curry on the way in. Again, action kind of stalled against the fence. Yeah, you know, he's, he's putting some head pressure on. He's a, obviously a big guy, like I say, 160 kilo guy. Putting a lot of pressure on. I just like to see him using it a little more. You know, yeah, Curry's many, defending many well. Defending. But yeah, he is defending well. Yeah, Curry is doing a good job of just tying him up. You know, he's making him work, you know, sort of tiring him out. But that's better head pressure now from John. Yeah, it definitely is. And that's what Marshall needs to do. He needs to use his weight, use his strength. Oh, big oh. shots. No, he's big really shots. rocked him there, though. He's definitely rocked him quite Both badly guys. there, but recovered quickly as Curry. Marshall's taking some shots of his own now. Both guys swinging for the fences now, Ian. These guys are throwing bombs, and they are big guys. So up against the cage right in front of us now. 30 seconds left of this round. 
This is going to be a tiring round for uh, for both guys now. They both, well, they, both, up. they both took some heavy shots there, Jamie. Yeah, they're both clinching up now. Nice shot again there. Some great advice from the crowd here. Certainly is. Couple of foot stomps there from Curry. This is coming to the end of this round. And there we go. That's, there's a, a lot of damage to the right eye there of John Marshall. So second round here. Both guys looking pretty tired, to be honest. Ian. Very, very tired. I don't think that minute was long enough. <clears throat> is it going to be more of the same swinging for the fences or is John going to try and use a bit of that holding again like he was doing that first round he's felt the power of Curry now oh, oh spinning back kick there from Curry spinning back kick to the thigh oh he's mixing over the things top. up yeah, quite well here much better start for the, to the round another leg kick there a lot of weight going to that uh, kick as he well. He could get a finish here. John is not liking this at all. So John pushing up against the cage now. Marshall going to look for this takedown, I'd say. Yeah, well Marshall needs to work for the takedown. He's obviously, he's, Curry's getting the better of the stand-up. Marshall needs to get the takedown and dominate that top position like he did earlier. Yeah, but he's struggling to get that takedown at the minute. He's, he's putting a lot of head pressure on him, but he's not trying to go for the takedown because I think he's, he, I say he's tiring quite a lot now, he's Marshall. That was, was a nice shot, and that definitely was into the inside thigh. And Curry felt that. Yeah, he really did. You could hear him. I don't know what he said. He said something there to John after that knee. Marshall. He's using the head, nice head control again from Marshall, though. Good work nice there from Curry knees, though. Yeah. Watch, the clutch, watch the clinch there from, uh, from Marshall. He's gonna get Curry definitely has a better stand up, but a, a big left hook comes in there from John. Yeah, both guys are swinging away there again. You know, it's little flurries now for both of them. So a bit of a low blow there. As always, five minutes if he needs it, Ian. Yeah, surely he well, won't he, need five he, minutes. He may just take a little bit more time there to get his breath back anyway. <laughs> DeFree shouting to him there. He's got the five minutes if he needs it. Phil DeFree is obviously heavyweight. UFC yeah, yeah. fighter. Yeah. Hoping at some point to see the rematch with him and Rob Broughton. That'd be a, you know, I know we almost had that on the on the show. I think yeah, I think it's uh, it's been in the in, in the works a few times. Yeah, I think it'd be a good one to see. A couple of problems stopping it, but I think uh, that has to happen at some point. Rob Broughton a true heavyweight. <laughs> he really is, yeah. The freeze some great fights in the UFC. So he must be ready to go now, I think, John. Yeah, he's nodding to his corner. He's ready for to continue this uh, second but round. Don't, don't forget, though, at the same time, Lee Curry's also getting a rest as well. Yeah, certainly. Uh, uh, you know, watch he, for him coming out with some good, solid yeah, striking you know, now. He, you know, his, I his think striking's he's, been looking good. He's looking at uh, John and thinking he's tired him, so I'd watch him probably come in and, and throw some big shots now. Bit of blood from the nose of uh, John Marshall. Yeah, well, he's, he's, he's took the brunt of the stand-up, really, I think. That's a good one to the midsection. Nice spinning kick there. Spinning back kick, yeah. He's definitely feeling these, he's John Marshall. Marshall. Marshall's Ooh. looking fairly beat up at the moment. There. Yeah, he's, he's, he's looking mouth, well. mouth wide open. He's, he's going for a lot of uh, like clinch work and uh, you know cage grappling, but he's not really going for much on the takedown. Jimmy, when they hit the cage and the actual whole cage moved. Yeah, that definitely did. Oh, 
So we're about halfway through the second round, halfway through the fight. If it goes the distance, both guys looking tired. John Marshall looking probably the more tired of the two. He's took the most punches. He did have that dominance sort of. Oh, nice oh. elbow there from Curra. Over the top, but again, you know, Marshall putting that pressure on. You know, there's a, a long way this fight to go yet, Ian, you know. And Bo, you know, Marshall's looking extremely tired, but he's obviously putting that pressure on, but going to be exerting more energy here now. Well, John looking to have so much... He's got to watch the knees from there. His head knowledge and advice, cage side. There's a lot of guys come down to help him, spur him along, but Curry, for me, kind of edging away. John's not done anything much other than hold against the fence. Yeah, he's getting punched up really up against the cage. Even though he's putting the pressure on, he's still getting hit a hell of a lot here. Nothing significant, don't get me wrong, but you know, it doesn't, doesn't need to be. Well, says there's a long way to go still in this fight for the fighters and the fans. I'd say that, uh, that John Marsh is definitely going to want this uh, little break now, but he's a minute long enough. It, it, it is it, and, and can he, you know, points-wise, you've got to wonder how this has been scored, because Curry's the one working, really, but he's pinned against the fence. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of clinch work, there's a lot of grabbing on in this fight. Well, 10 seconds left in this second round. And uh, you've got to wonder what has Marshall got left because he's, he's just held on for that round. Yeah, he has, yeah, but he's got another round of this yet. And, uh, you know, I mean, maybe he can hold up against the cage again, but it's whether the judges are going to score it on him holding or if he's actually being punched. Because at the minute, Lee Curry's landing the shots and, and, and Marshall's not, not really landing anything at the minute. He's just, he's just sort of grabbing on. Looking very tired here at the minute, though. Curry obviously needs to defend the takedown and keep him standing. That's where he's, he's at his best. Very static work, though, from Marshall there. Curry needs to stay light on his feet, moving around, not let um, not let Marshall back him up like he just has. The cage, cage moved about, a little another, bit there. about another three inches, I think, there. Up against the cage again. You know, I don't see Marshall really getting a takedown from here. He's not done so far in the last round. And I just don't see him doing it again. I think he's going to grab on a little bit. And he's going to go for a guillotine there. But he is, are his arms even long enough to, to get a tight guillotine on that position? Well, that's it. It's a, against someone the size of that. He's tapped him out. He's tapped him out there. With um, didn't quite see that. Ian, what? What? I think he tapped him out the the guillotine. Guillotine, with the guillotine there. Yeah. Uh, you know, he, he had to. Uh, and like I say, he was a big guy, so he had to really try and work his arms round, get the, at that tight position. But he managed to do that. John was obviously exhausted, so I think any stoppage of the breath at all was going to do that to him. It was going to really cause some damage. Yeah. Uh, 